Hello everyone, it is episode 6 of Road to Glory. Let's keep up to date, keep you guys in tune of what's going on today. So yes, it's day 6. We are levelling up. We've done obviously what we've done today. But the really important thing about obviously continuing on from episode 5. So you can see this is all in one day. We've pushed a little bit. So we've gone on to our lumber mill now. It's almost level 12 which is going to be really good. Because it's going to allow us to push a load of, of these claims on these main quests hopefully. And we've been able to finish out our wall. And now really big achievement building towards city hall 15 so as you can see we've got two days and so on to go on for now we're going to keep watching it but we've got enough speeds here just to push it through i think it's about one day and eight hours but you can see him a low on speeds right and this is not good if you're in a free to play position you're like mm, how can i get more speeds so one way is obviously through doing some forts but or killing even these patrols around yeah but another really insane way which i'm already doing is the august stones just in locked scouting so now anyone in our region in 765 can start scouting all of anywhere in C server one here so if i could find in theory a castle around here like this i could send a scout all the way to this guy right and that's a really good tip if you're trying to scout you know certain regions to find enemies you could try and find a castle in one of these blocks like here and send a scout to them and then it will allow your scout to walk all the way through all of the regions, you know. And then you can, you know, clear whenever you want to clear. But this is what we're going to be doing today. This is what I'm going to be grinding on video. So you can see that I do do it. And this is what you guys need to be doing too. So we found a new wonder. So let's go and look at that cool thing. That's nice. I do love the wonder here. The wolf shrine. Blazing flames flickered in the wind and the orc stood silent gazing at a wolf upon the ice. That does look beautiful man. Just just look at that. You can see even all the way into this little bit of like fire that's there. What a beautiful monument or what you know world shrine here. So we're going to click explore. We've got the chapter unlocked. And now because we've got this nice chapter unlocked. We've got some quests to do right. So let's go and find these areas. So we've got this village to do. Nice easy. Ask someone about it. Let's get some dust and speed ups. But the general thing what we're trying to do. Is obviously complete it right. So let's go to the next one. Go here. Click visit. And it's talk about an orc right. The orc staring at the wardrobe. He's feeling a shape. We can say take him back to his city and we can use the rally heart. There we go. He feels a lot happy about himself. And we've got a free continent map, which we should be keeping as well. Just to let you guys know, keeping it, trying to keep on topic. But these maps that you gain, even though it says it scraps at the end of each season, soon as you've defogged the entire map, exactly like Rise of Kingdoms, you're going to be able to actually, you know, convert those into five minute speed ups. So if you need speed ups, that is a really good way to do it. You can just obviously keep pushing um, the maps and maps and maps and then turn them all the maps into speed ups at the end, right? So that's what we're going to do. We've got two more to go, so let's go here. So now let's see what this level three wants to say. Let's bribe him with mana and then we get some nice trading speeds, dust, and we've got some more eight hour you know work resource limits we don't really care about that so now let's go again into the main quest line we'll go to the bottom section for the season adventure plus the quest from you know your world mo monuments and now we are claiming this one let's help him teach him some new techniques there we go got another one and a bunch of dust there right so now we've completed it, we're going to go back here, we're going to go and claim and click explore, bang, there's the chest, and this is why we're doing it, we just gave two hours for free for doing that, took not even five minutes to do guys, free heads, and more importantly, we got 
tier four units and we can use these still we can summon them and we can use them they will heal they will not disappear guys you don't lose any troops in this game so you have 400 tier four flying units depending on your you know faction and spring warden so we've got the flying cavalry unit here so we've got this already done great achievement for us so let's keep getting our scout boys going and now since we've got the scout you know running out we can see our scouters going up our scout marker shall i say so what we're going to be doing is looking mainly if we can for any of the supplies in water because if you're in water here as you can see we're gaining the building speed ups that we need but these ones are gaining our resources which are just the ones on land so just remember if you need resources go for the ones on land if you need speed ups you want to be going for the ones in water Obviously, I need to get my scouters out there more often than not, so we can obviously get more, you know, speeds. But it's just started, you know, it is what it is. So if you're wondering, obviously, how scouting does work, we've gone over it quite a lot of times. But in the Augustone right now, when you get to the day of destiny and it is completed, you know, regardless of when, you know, if you've completed it or not, you will be able to scout past anyone, right? In any level one pass. So just remember, when you go through here, you can scout your region all the way. And as soon as you hit this and complete it, you're going to be able to scout everywhere else. So we're going to start doing that. And that's, that's today's video. We're going to keep scouting, keep powering up and gaining whatever we can. So obviously we've gained dust. So we're going to go into our artifacts here we're gonna level up our infantry one just a little bit just so we can get these guys to level 20 artifacts and get them a little bit stronger for the dragon trial so we can keep pushing it so just what i did do off camera because these are a little bit boring we pushed so far from what was it 25 and we've gone all the way up to 40 so far we're going to be doing these as well but what I'm going to do on camera are the side branches here, here, and obviously down here. So we're going to cover all those that I haven't done. So don't worry. We're going to do a separate video on them because they're their own little bit. So that is the account so far. We're growing. Obviously, we're at 752k. Once this completes, which is really nice, we're going to gain a, a nice 12k bonus. So we're going to be at 800k. Obviously, we're not trying to go as hard as we can. If you're a low spender, you would have had both of these by now. But for a free-to-play player like myself, we've almost hit 1 million. If maybe I had a bit more time, you know, in the game, because obviously I've been working my real job, like any of the free-to-play players generally do. They might be working, they might be at school, you know, you do what you do. If you've got only so much time hitting this 1 million marker might be the thing you want to try and go for. But if you don't, Hitting 750,000, as you can see, is really easy. So you can get the 700k no matter what within the timer. We've still got 13 hours to go, obviously. So we're going to see if we're going to be able to hit this 1 million today. But in my opinion, I might, um, I won't be able to. There's just a little bit too much of demand to hit that 200k. We're going to have to get some insane levels maybe on our heroes. You know, buff these guys up really high with leveling and that might have cheese us up to 1 million as well as our artifacts so we're gonna get there we're gonna see but that is it so far i hope you enjoyed the episode as you can see we're gonna be grinding today on the scouting so we're gonna just keep scouting as much as we can we've done our daily cp we've done everything else the only thing i am doing at the moment is finishing off even though we've completed it the road to glory we're trying to get these speed ups as well as these five and we're going to complete two more forts nice and easy to do we just got to find one level one fort somewhere there we are and just send our units someone will come which is great so we don't have to worry about it and then obviously once that's killed we're going to find this one kill this one and that'll be completed another objective for speed ups done but that is going to be it, guys. You know, nice, easy live commentary, you know, live video of me leveling up the account here with Server 65. 
obviously we've done our main dailies in the morning we've done that video and covered it and now it's a little bit few hours on and you're gonna see basically what i've been doing today right so my plan today is obviously to scout as much as we can as well as to gain as many of those supplies as soon as possible in order for us to grow faster and get to that tier 3 city hall 16 which is our main focus right now as a free to play player so if you've enjoyed the video and you've enjoyed episode six of the road to glory series smash a like comment and subscribe to the channel i'm here giving you guys this series so you can see what i'm doing day to day and you've got at least some idea what to be doing you know yourselves as well i do cover all your videos and guides on heroes behemoths event you name it open field commentary shout casting i've got it you know so if you enjoy my stuff Again, support the channel. It's very, very insane that we're over a thousand. I can't believe I'm actually saying that. I didn't even expect to, but with you guys' support, obviously, we're going to keep growing. We're going to keep pushing. And with that video in the bag and another one down for today, stay safe, stay sneaky, and peace out, guys.